Good evening. Depending on where you are in this world and depending on when you get to see this post, guys. Anybody that's in this world trying to do good, I'm sure sometimes, like me, you just get exhausted, you know. Because sometimes I feel like we get punished for trying to do the right thing. If there's anybody else who feels like that, please feel free to let me know how you feel. Because sometimes I just feel like... Sometimes I just feel like the world... Well, when I say the world, it obviously it's a sweeping generalization. But sometimes I feel that people actually just punish you for doing the right thing or for even trying to do the right thing, you know. So guys, what do we do? You know, if you do bad, they punish you. If you try to do good, it's like they even want to punish you even the more. But anyway... We do the best that we can. If you're somebody who is still in support of doing the right thing, thank you very much. So, let me quickly do this and then I'll go and look for some feel-good videos to watch. Because <laughs> the way that the world is getting these days, I don't know what you people are worshipping, but me, I have decided to follow my God in all things. So... Anything that you say about me mm, that is not good, if it is not of God, I reject it. Mm, I reject it wholeheartedly in Jesus' holy name because I know who I am. Mm. <laughs> I know who I am. Mm, I know who I am. I know whose I am. So, anything that you say about me that is not for me. I just reject it in Jesus' holy name. I just reject it totally in Jesus' holy name. They get the big money. They get the big money. To my mind, they get the big money. They should know how to do their job. And if they don't know how to do their job properly, they should at least know how to ask for help politely. If anybody's asking my help for anything... Mm. Me, I want them to give me something in return. That's just how I'm feeling. Mm. And I am not a witch. I am a child of God. Uh, sorry, to them. I had to stand up. Mm. Mm. Hopefully, sooner or later. I'm praying, I'm praying sooner or later mm. that God, God will give me a, a beautiful location a beautiful location where I can do beautiful videos for you guys I, I'm hoping for a beautiful location where I can do beautiful videos for you guys also a beautiful background I mean, if these mofos can be following me around or other people around 24 hours of the day, how, how, is, how, how is it not possible for them to track, you know, surveillance of criminals you know, to find out what they have been doing? Let me forget about all these people and concentrate on this my morning routine that I'm doing. Let me see if I would actually be able to get rid of these age spots. I've had them for years. It's high time that I actually got rid of them at last. And guys, if you have age spots as well and you wanna get rid of your age spots. I know that actually some people don't mind age spots. Some people don't mind them at all. You know, just like wrinkles, some people just say, okay, they're, you know, the wrinkles are part of me, they're part of my journey. But me, I want to get rid of these age spots, especially the ones on my neck. So guys, if you want to join in, please feel free to join in. 
It's just that I'm not doing morning routine every day because I just don't feel I need to do it every day with you guys. I really don't feel I need to do it every day with you guys. So that's why I stopped doing it. Mm. And apart from that, I'm the kind of person that just sometimes I'm the kind of person I like peace of mind. I really do love my peace of mind. So sometimes I would actually just give myself a break from people, you know. Other people might do it and they won't say anything about it. But when I do it, you get all of these people, you know, who all of a sudden, because I've done it, you know, all of a sudden they're going to wake up and they're going to jump up and they're going to feel like they want to do a video. So sometimes I'm like, I can't be bothered with all these troublemakers. I'm telling you guys the truth. Sometimes I'm like, I can't be bothered with all of these troublemakers. So sometimes I will just, you know, give them their way. Unless I really feel like, okay, this is a video I really need to do. Because as we all know, these things work on so many different levels. But sometimes I'm just like, let me give myself a break from human beings. Hmm? Sometimes I just say to myself, let me just give myself a break from human beings. Uh, if, if my face on the video is making some of these motherfuckers, you know, angry, let me just remove my face so that they don't see my face. <laughs> mm, for, the one, for the ones who cannot stand to see people who tell the truth. Mm? So anyway, guys, that's it. For those of you who've been missing my morning routine, I'm not going to be doing morning routine every single day. Mm -hmm. Because I just don't need to. <laughs> and my hair, my hair is actually growing nicely. So, the next time you guys see my hair, you're going to be surprised. <laughs> Spots of them! My beautiful Spartans, mm? my beautiful Spartans, some of my Spartans are so loyal, mm? some of my Spartans, they are so loyal, just like me, mm? some of my Spartans are so loyal, the way that they even come through for me, sometimes I'll be shocked, I'll be like, mm? like really, you did that for me, hmm? Anyway, guys, mm -hmm. guys, don't worry about anything. Mm -hmm. God is still God. <laughs> God is still God. Mm -hmm. And he never changes. That's one thing I love about God. He never changes. Mm -hmm. So whatever he said he would do, he would do. And the bad people, the bad people, they can never ever go scot-free, guys. That's one thing that I want you to know. Bad people, they can never, ever, ever go scot-free. Mm -mm -mm. They cannot. They cannot. They must always pay for what they have done. <clears throat> guys, excuse me. You know, like, all of those people that look for my trouble. You know, like, all of those people, like, some of those, what, so what do I call them? Some of those want to be, they want to be a superstar overnight, you know, they want to be a superstar overnight, they want to be a famous actor overnight, basically some of the people that want to be big overnight, so when they decide that they want to be big overnight, what is their first thought? The first thought of some of them is, uh, okay, let's make fun of Anne, let's, you know, sing a song about Anne, guys. Whenever God decides to reply to those people, <laughs> guys, I'm always shocked. I am always shocked at the way that he replies at them. Guys, you guys know very well that there's so many of those people who jumped on that bandwagon. Today, they no longer have a career. Hmm? My Spartans know, you guys know, so many of those guys that jumped on that bandwagon of, okay, let's make fun of Anne, you know, let's join in, uh, sing a song about Anne, do a play about Anne, write, guys, so many of those people, 
today today you'll be looking for them as a matter of fact some of them you have even forgotten about them because they're no longer relevant hmm? yeah some so many of them we don't see them we don't hear about them anymore they're no longer trending they're no longer relevant why because they just didn't have to do it you know it was just unnecessary what they did they just didn't have to do it but they felt that it was a quick way for them to earn it to earn money guys i'm not going to turn myself into mrs malapo even some of the ones that are doing it now in nollywood i'm just looking at them i just look at them because i see the way the other person went that is the same way that you are going to go as well guys when people look for your trouble especially people that you supported especially people that you never ever had any issue with and then they decide that they want to look for your trouble guys don't worry about anything honestly don't worry about those kind of people because when god is ready to deal with them you'll be so delighted as a matter of fact as a matter of fact you will be shocked as a matter of fact when god decides that he wants to deal with those people you will be so shocked so guys i'm just gonna say to you guys what i say to myself all the time i am teaching myself how to you know just be really grown up with people and just you know be be calm in so many situations i've actually gotten to the stage where i can sleep through anything mm? i have gotten to the stage where i can sleep through anything and guys that is a big deal that is a big deal because it used to be that when a pin would drop i would wake up but now when they come around when they come around here trying to wake me up or trying to disturb me or trying to get me to talk when i decide i have closed my eyes and i want to sleep there's nothing that they will do i will not answer them so i am learning every day i am learning i am learning the art of silence i am learning how to ignore people i am learning that it's not everybody and it's not everything that I have to answer to. And guys, if you can learn it for yourself, it will bring a lot of peace into your life. Guys, sometimes they will be sometimes they will be creating all manner of drama in this place, in this vicinity. Guys, I will sleep, even I will be snoring. <laughs> guys, I am proud of myself. I am proud of myself. Because I know how far I have come. Hmm? I am proud of myself. I know how far I have come with this thing. I know how far I have come. So, it's, hmm? if you decide you want to do something for yourself in this life, please, I would advise you go about it the right way but don't feel that you're gonna build your market on top of somebody else's pain mm? there is nobody in this world who is going to profit from my tears again <laughs> it's never ever gonna happen never ever gonna happen not in this lifetime not in the next you ain't profiting one penny shishi kobo from me from my pain my tears my suffering like like it ain't happening it ain't happening it's not happening because i made that decision that it's not gonna happen they are not profiting hmm? then i will i will swallow them all i will swallow them hmm? i know what i need to do to get those people out of my life hmm? psalm 35 if you're somebody that is going through anything in life, Psalm 35. If if you want to eat it every day, like the way you eat your favorite food, Psalm 35, from morning to night, <laughs> you will see what will happen to the people who are disturbing you. Hmm? Psalm 35. It is one of the most powerful psalms, psalms in the Bible. Psalm 35. Hmm? Guys, use it use it see what god will do for you even if you're somebody who doesn't believe in god this is how god calls people into his presence mm -hmm. 
through problems. Mm -hmm. Maybe that problem that you have, maybe that's his way of calling you into his kingdom, of drawing you to himself. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, most people don't come to know God. Well, they might know him, but they might just know him in a casual way. But it's normally through adversity that people, you know, tend to develop a deeper, you know, relationship with God to actually find out who God really is. Guys, if there's anybody disturbing you in your life, use Psalm 35 on them. Don't take my word for it. Try it. Try it and see what will happen. Use Psalm 35 on them. Hmm? Use Psalm 35 on them. There's so many people that I supported in this lifetime, but the comebacks that I got from them. Guys, if you have ever been to that point in life where you're so hurt by something that you can't even cry, you would understand what I'm talking about. I reached that stage with so many people, like people that I supported, hmm? People that I supported, I cheered for them. Not because I wanted anything from them, but just because I liked them, I liked what they were doing. But because in their mind I was unpopular. If you hear the things that people that I supported from day one were telling me. Guys, I don't even have the words to tell you guys. Let me not even go back there so that I do not trigger myself. It's just till today. Till today, I still look at those people and I'm shocked. Because I'm like, huh? I'm, I'm like, I supported you. Sometimes I will even be saying to myself, I will sometimes I'll even go back in my mind, I'll be thinking, okay, at what point did I offend these people? Mm, what did I do? You don't have to say anything to offend people. You don't. You don't have to send they you don't you don't have to say anything to offend them. They might just decide that they are the stronger pack and that you're the weaker one. That's what they have decided within themselves. It's not true. Because there's nothing weak about me. The fact that the fact that I decide to follow God and the fact that I decide, okay, I wanna be doing the right thing as much as possible to the degree that I can do. I don't believe that makes me a weak person. I believe that makes me a stronger person because it is more difficult to actually do the right thing. If you think that I'm joking, try it. 30 days. If you think that what I'm saying is a bunch of crock, try for 30 days to just do the right thing. Try it and then come back and talk to me. It's difficult. It's difficult. Eh? It's difficult to keep on saying, okay, I want to just keep on, you know, fighting that good fight. No matter what people say to me. No matter how tired, how many times people call me out of my name. Guys, there's no name. There's no name on earth that they will not call you. Mm? So, I have said so many things. I have said so many things in this video. Please. I believe that the right information will go to the right people. Mm? I believe the right information will get to the right people. Mm? I try my best. I try to do my best. People say, no matter how much you try, some people say, it's not good enough. You're not doing enough. Am I going to kill myself for them? No, I'm not going to kill myself for them. I'm not going to kill myself for anybody. Yeah, that one goes without saying. I'm not going to do it. And there's no juju that they can use on me that will work. Any juju that they try to use on me, it will backfire. Any kind of juju that they try to use on me, I know, Sanya, it will backfire. It will. Okay. So, to my lovely spotters. My lovely spotters, guys. Hmm? If you enjoy my video, mm, do the necessary. If you don't enjoy my video, mm, I don't know what to say again. No. If you don't enjoy my video, then you didn't enjoy my video. If you enjoyed my video, I really hope that you're not too famous or too important to do the necessary. Hmm? Otherwise, I just stay in my bed. And I'll just be watching the kind of videos that I enjoy on YouTube. Yeah. So, 
these are the products that you saw me use today if i like something i will talk about it mm? why do people repeat they repeat for emphasis mm? that's why people say the same thing over and over again we do it for emphasis mm? and for the people who did not hear it before mm? some people are frustrated they will just come on youtube <laughs> To look for who to fight with mm? Mm? You're doing good things You're helping them But still They are fighting with you That is helping them mm? But the But the uh, But the people that they really should be fighting with They cannot fight with those people Because They are intimidated by them mm? Guys Miss Water number 6 I pray to God almighty Please when I go to save us let me not get distracted by things that are cute and shiny let me not forget to get this one because last time i went to save us i know i know that i had it in mind to buy this but i didn't buy it i ended up buying some other things so please god let me not get distracted when i go shopping let me actually buy what i want to buy let me not get distracted by things that are pink cute and shiny Mm, as I always do And Johnson's mm. Johnson's <laughs> Guys Anytime I talk about a Johnson's product Mr. Baby Powder will appear <laughs> Guys When they say that real life is stranger than fiction They didn't say any word of a lie mm? Guys I pray, I pray to God Almighty that you do not find yourself in a situation where, you know, things, things happen to you that are just so surreal, you know, and you're like, what in God's name, what in God's name is wrong with people? Hmm? What in God's name is wrong with people? Guys, do you know that anytime I talk about Johnson's or any Johnson's product, Mr. Baby Powder things that I'm talking about him. <laughs> Hmm? I don't. What is it about money and power that puts people in a position whereby they're either losing their head or they're getting to the point where they're actually losing their heads, guys? When I wear certain hair or certain wigs, some people think that I'm talking about them. I'm just wearing the hair. I'm just wearing the hair. I'm just wearing the wig. But in their mind. Because they have big ego, big, big, big ego. They think I'm talking about them. Guys, these people are nuts. Mm? I'm telling you that some of these people, they are truly nuts. Mm? It is in dealing with them, in relating with them, that I realize how nuts they are. You know? Some of them are truly mentally unstable. I'm telling you the gospel truth, guys. And I just say to myself, like, seriously, like, seriously, some of them, they are reading meanings into all kinds of things. Mm? They're reading meaning into things that have absolutely nothing to do with them. If not for the fact that they are, they are mentally uh, un unstable, mm? obviously, they would not be, be trying to join dots together mm? where, where it doesn't exist. But some of them, they're just... And they don't even have people that are telling them the truth. Mm, this is another problem that some of these people have. They don't actually have p people who would actually just tell them the truth the way it is. Mm? So they'll be reading meanings into all kinds of things. Mm? Anytime I wear certain wigs, certain people will just appear. My mind has already told me that they will appear because they have been doing it for decades. It is only God that can help them all. It is only God that can help them. Anyway, guys, like, comment, subscribe if you like my video. If you like my video, like my video. If you don't like my video, then I'm sure there's so many other videos on YouTube that you will like. My hair is growing. Uh... If you're wondering why I'm talking about all these things, it's because people like to know. The genuine Spartans, they like to know. 
so about the hair obviously the hair is growing at some point so i'll put more color in it mm -hmm. i think well natural hair it does what it does so you guys you'll see the progression and that's it i'll do another video when god leads me to do another video <laughs> i will do another random beautiful video mm -hmm. So that's it guys please like comment and subscribe if you do enjoy longer videos let me know the reason why i don't do longer videos if this is the first time that you're coming across one of my videos the reason why i don't do the long videos is because it just takes a while to upload for me to upload them onto this platform youtube that is for anybody who is actually seeing the video for the first time so thank you very much guys have yourselves a wonderful day and my name is a love love conquers all no matter what people tell you love conquers all and love is the best way god help me to get rid of these age spots i don't want the age spots anymore i want to get rid of them